with us for the women's 49 kilo competition earlier in the day. A really high competitive standard, a wonderful start to the whole championship. So the first appearance of Bindarani Solak Haibam, 23 years of age. One kilos, that's well within her compass. Yes, it is. A small skip back as she received the bar. She just throws the shoulders back a little, which is what takes momentum backwards. Doesn't matter, it's received nicely overhead. Looking down, I wouldn't encourage that. I'd encourage eyes to remain focused on one point. But executes with ease, first attempt in the competition. suggests that this woman is very much going to be a, contender, a contender today. Bindarani, Sorok Haibam. Really quick, really explosive. Three white lights on her way, 84 kilos, and that establishes the Commonwealth Games record. Well, it just shows you how heavy Catherine was starting there, 83 kilos, right on the record. Here we have 84 business as normal for India. One of three sisters, also a brother in the family. Five times British champion, Claire Moreau. We're going to see a lot more of her in this competition. And also uh, this lady, 86 kilos. Now, this would be, for her, a two kilo personal best. No lift. Let's see what the referees make of it. She's celebrating as if she's got it, and she has two to one. Centre referee saw the press out on the left elbow, which is what I saw. She's taking a look here, there's no movement at the jury table, so she's got away with it. Well, in, coincidentally, the uh, central referee is uh, Shiamala Shetty from uh, India. She didn't think that was a good lift, but as you said, two to one, and she's got the lift, and ultimately that's three out of three. So she gets presence on the weightlifting roster here with a wonderful gold medal from Chanu Mirabai in the women's 49 kilos earlier today. And uh, here's... Their representative, uh, Bindarani Sorokaiba, 110 kilos. than Freya's. This is going to be tight. This lift up in picture right now still needs to make up the deficit from the snatch. But she has two attempts and Freya has just the one left. But she actually has two attempts at her spin. So, no. second attempt. Nigerian breathes a sigh of relief and 
Suddenly, we have just two attempts left. Oh, this is tight. It's tight because lifters are missing. But there is still two lifters here that can vie for the gold medal position. But Freya is in the stronger position because she is on 198. Look at the bend there in her left elbow. Then it's straight. Definite press out. That's the reason for the failed lift. Look at this, uh, 196 would only take her to 202, but it would take her to silver medal position. She's got 196, she got the 110, failed at 114, now she's going 116, that would give her 6 kilos, that would only take her to 202. Yeah. So she'd miss out on the gold, but going they, for the silver. they obviously feel that this is the limit. Nigeria's first gold medal of these games in the world of weightlifting. Representing England, Freya Moro. So her first Commonwealth Games medal to England's Freya Moro. 89 kilos in the snatch to go with 109 kilos, including her British Championship record, 198 kilos uh, total to take the bronze medal. Eight kilos uh, representing a new personal best total for Freya. And for quite a while, it could have gone uh, many ways indeed, but in the end, representing India, Pindarani Sodakaibam. Pindarani uh, Sodakaibam of India, a gutsy last attempt to lift her from bronze into overall silver. Clean and jerk games record of 116 kilos to give her a total of 202, which ultimately was a kilo short of the woman who's about to be presented with the Commonwealth gold medal for the women's 55 kilos. Gold that is 23-year-old Adiyat uh, Olorinoye of uh, Nigeria. won the Commonwealth Championship title in Tashkent in Uzbekistan last December, but now wins Commonwealth gold. Well, once again, a very really nice finish to the day. Three smiling faces, three achievers. It's been an intense day of weightlifting here, and I hope you've all enjoyed it. I know many of you are up in the early hours of the morning.